Incorporate cuffing into your self-defense. It's extremely important. On your toes. Bounce, bounce. Oh, that's right. Don't let it get you. Don't let him get you. So here's the issue. So one of, Morgan's doing overall a good job. But what we want her to do is when she cuffs, we don't want her to cuff down here and leave her face open. So when she cuffs, we want her to cuff, cuff, and get back to her cover. Bang, bang. Bang, 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 bang. And then come back here. Bang, bang, bang. When the hand comes close, bang, 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 bang. Right here. And I want her to move. So, chase, chase, constant movement. On your toes, bounce, bounce. Oh, that's right. Don't let it get you, don't let him get you. Tighten up those hands. Much tighter, that's good. Hey, that was quick, that's good. Now, it's useful to remember that what if that hand has a knife in it? So are you gonna let that thing touch you? No. Are you gonna react to it differently now? Oh, <laughs> not good. You have a cut. Yeah. Cuffing is especially useful for self-defense when you're up against someone who is faster, longer armed, and able to hit you, but yet you cannot hit them. If you cuff the arms and you cause them some discomfort and you get the flinch reaction, then you can leap in and then you can punch to the face, body, neck, and so forth. It's also useful to remember that against someone with a knife, if you play defense, then you're just going to get eventually cut, stabbed, and probably severely injured or worse. So, when someone has a knife, you can use cuffing to pummel the arm. When you get the flinch reaction, then you can leap in, hit, and perhaps attempt a disarm. But more than likely, run. So, incorporate cuffing into your self-defense practice. It's very, very important. Don't forget to like, share, and to subscribe to this YouTube channel. And also, you can subscribe to our daily text messages. We send out an inspirational text every single day. Follow the link in the comments. Get your daily inspiration. Thanks for watching. Take care.